Disney's Mickey Mouse Club is back, now rebranded as Club Mickey Mouse, the show that famously kickstarted the careers of Ryan Gosling, Britney Spears, Christina Aguilera, and Justin Timberlake has a whole new cast and a brand new look. And it's exclusively available on social media. One of its brightest stars is 17-year-old Big Will Simmons, a dancer who's just five feet tall. Simmons claims he's been performing since he was eight years old, and thanks to Disney, he just got his big break. Here's what you need to know about Big Will Simmons. Pro Dancer Simmons is barely old enough to drive, yet he's got almost a decade of professional dancing experience under his belt. In an interview with ABC News, Simmons said, Well, I started dancing when I was around five because of my sister. You know, she had problems with her foot and she had to get into dancing. One of his highest profile gigs was dancing in the video for the song Never Catch Me by Flying Lotus, featuring Kendrick Lamar. The video won a VMA and Simmons even went on to perform live with the artist at Coachella. The Acting Bug in an interview with Teen Weekly Insider, Simmons revealed his sights are set on the silver screen, saying, I am very passionate about acting. I aspire to be the next Samuel L. Jackson, Morgan Freeman, or Will Smith. I've booked acting jobs and even a movie. I love being able to transform during a scene and become someone completely different. While Simmons' own credits show a budding acting career and kid-friendly fare, he earned positive reviews for his grittier work in Mike Posner's music video for Be As You Are. The Detroit Metro Times wrote that Simmons shines as the video's protagonist, so while he may be donning Mickey ears for now, the kid's got range and big aspirations. Disney Dream In an interview on Oh My Disney, Simmons claims becoming a member of Club Mickey Mouse is the realization of a childhood dream, admitting he grew up watching That's So Raven, The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody, and Hannah Montana. Simmons said, My dream as an actor was to always have my own show on Disney Channel. And the older I got, the more I thought that wasn't going to happen. And this is proof right here that you should never, ever give up on your dreams. Performing in the Super Bowl Backing up Missy Elliott during Katy Perry's Super Bowl 49 halftime show is Simmons' self-described greatest accomplishment. He told Teen Weekly Insider, It was a long, hard two weeks of rehearsals, and I had to learn a flip that everyone could do but me. If I didn't learn it, I couldn't be in the performance. So I took gymnastics every day for two weeks and my body was killing me. But I learned the flip. Show Rituals In a Q&A session on his YouTube page, Simmons opened up about his pre-show prep, which includes a full-body warm-up. But he also shared another pre-show secret. I just don't go pee. I'm the one that's like, I have to hold it because I actually do better on stage if I don't pee, which is really weird. Fluent Japanese Simmons is such a huge fan of anime, he actually learned to read, write, and speak Japanese, according to his profile on Oh My Disney. In the interview, he says, Hopefully, one day, I get to go to Japan. Disney, Ohio City. On top of that, in his Q&A session on his YouTube page, Simmons answers a fan's question, What is the 50th pick on your phone? by scrolling through only to find a screenshot of a Dragon Ball Z character. Charity work Simmons stays grounded in his career by giving back. Not only does he teach dance to underprivileged kids, he's also the ambassador for the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children's program, KidSmarts. He told Teen Weekly Insider, I was part of a social media campaign and safety dance video that contained a rap and dance about how to stay safe from strangers and what to do if a stranger approached them. Homeschool like a lot of kids who grew up in the entertainment business, Simmons' education has been non-traditional, but that doesn't mean he hasn't done well. Even as a homeschooled student, Simmons says he recognizes the value of being proactive, telling Teen Weekly Insider, I'm finding what works best for me is to always be ahead of my coursework. That way, if something comes up, I don't have to stress about school and working at the same time. Thanks for watching. Click the Nikki Swift icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.